Hey there, folks. I'm Zerfall. I'm Old Dragon. And we are back in uh, Winna Castle, or Castle Winna. Depending on the way you like to say things. Yes, that is the second of the three castles. And uh, I was going to suggest that we don't go back to this um, cast this uh, dungeon yet because of the kill kill zones. That's fine by me. Yeah, I just um, I feel that we are just going to end up. We like the minions we have right now for the things that we're doing right now. So I think we're going to explore more of the non-dungeon stuff first. Because right now, the real way to get through them seems to just be brute forcing it. Like, either using yeah. minions to take the, the deaths or dying yourself and resurrecting people. Uh, we're not which, high enough level for that second part. No, but when like you have a cat minion, that's not a big deal. But when you've got uh, yeah. like Jojen, like the... yeah. The one minion you've had since the beginning of the game. Well, and with hundreds of hit points and multiple attacks, more attacks than uh, our people have. Ha have we been able to tell if our people are getting multiple attacks? They are sometimes, yes. Okay. I think I've, I've witnessed it. Uh, but uh, can we tell on their stat page? Did we see if that um, was... I don't know if we can actually just see that. I think it's just something that happens in combat. Um... Where is it? View. Yeah, I'm not seeing it anywhere here. Yeah. I wonder if there's something in the manual. I wonder I don't know if it has to do with your agility or just your leveling up or, or whatnot. Um But yeah, we also have like, you know, this chaotic ogre is pretty cool, but as soon as we go through a neutral zone, they're just going to die. Yeah. They're only 23. That's too young. And Befreda getting two swings at 1d40 damage with 444 hit points. Um, That's pretty good. I mean, at least half of the hits are going to be less than 40 damage. Or less than 20 damage. Well, less than 40. Well, I don't know. It, not every hit is a hit. You know what I'm saying. Sometimes they'll roll. True. <laughs> True. I mean, we're, we're trading off... Uh, I mean, it is possible that she does one point of damage, whereas any time lethal hits, he's doing at least seven. Um, but his max is 16 rather than 40. For, for now... She oh, definitely oh, oh. has a. She definitely has a much better uh, um, DPS, as the kids say these days. She's got dots up on every time. <laughs> Not quite. All right, I was just secretly in the background getting the map back up too, so I know what I'm doing. All right, so we're. <laughs> I guess we're ready to move out then. I think everyone's healed up. Yep. There's no no one. No, uh, no one can level so. up. Yep. Just watch out for poison is, I guess, what's going on. So straight north of us is the yeah. city of uh, Skabold. Yeah, we'll need to go around uh, some water, but that shouldn't be... Oh, there, there's, there's a actually a, a bridge. And isn't that where where the dungeon is, by that bridge? Well, we were, yeah, we were. it's by the bridge. We were headed towards, I think, that town just north of the bridge. And we okay. stumbled across the dungeon first. So I guess we're going to that... Yeah, uh, let's head to that town and then... That village. Uh, I think you went too far. That was the. Uh... All right, because the dungeon That's the got dungeon in my way right last there. time. It's right next to the bridge. Yeah. That's how they get you. Put a dungeon right next to the bridge and make you think that <laughs> things are going to be okay. There we go. We didn't even get combat on the way here. <gasps> Yay! I'm shocked. I'm odd. <laughs> Chassiana of Wamor gives you a shard from the Tablet of Uthar. More? Sweet. Some city walls have secret doors. Look for the dot. Dot's up on every time. Dot, dot, dot. She knows how to be a good warlock. 
Okay, so we're going to avoid dock. poison. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> well, we want to avoid it anyway, since we want to swing to the right a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we'll go, we'll go around the long way when we're going to the next uh, castle. All right, in we go. City of Scabold. I think we should go take the bridge. Oh, I meant we weren't going right more to get to... Is what I meant. Rather than okay. when I say long way around, I mean like going across the map rather than wrapping around the edges. Gotcha. I suspect this is a town where we should keep an eye out for dots. So let's just go around the outside yeah. of the town real quick. Because they just gave us that clue. And no one's poisoned. <laughs> I would never walk around like crazy when people are poisoned, hoping to make it work. <laughs> no, no. Ooh, hello. <laughs> a the golden. golden Oh, go go ahead. No, go ahead. A golden brown and equine creature is grazing leisurely on the estate. Name. Mine. My name is Unity. Job. I craze about. You wouldn't. You wouldn't happen to be related to Smith, are you? Info. Speak to others, and you may find what thou art looking for. Very high flute language for a horse. Yeah. Give. No, thank you. Uh, pay. Join. I've, I've nothing to sell. <laughs> Bye. Farewell. Also, a lot less rude than Smith. You want to try talking to the other one? Just see if it's the same. Yeah. There was another horse up there. Just. Is it a horse? Yeah, okay. It's the same. But one of these might not be. Right. All right, same name. As long as you got the same name, I think you're yeah. good to, to go. Just in case. All right. <laughs> That's what we're trying. But you're all clones. It's Dolly. And actually, do you know what? It seems like um, oh oh, now we go. This is a horse of a different color. <laughs> Indeed, this horse is different from the others, with a mane as fair as the snow on the mountains. Name? I am Baldemar. Job? I can't do a, I can't do a Winnie, so sorry. I was in the service of a great knight in many battles several moons ago. Moons, you say? Info. If thou art a brave paladin, I shall be in service to thee if I'm asked to join. Mm, oh, I don't think we have a paladin. Uh, yeah, that's different from a lord, isn't it? I believe so, yeah. I'm going to give it a try. Cannot join thee. Yeah. No, we just got two fighters. That's where it's at. Well, there's a horse here. Yeah. Uh, let me actually make a note of that. I mean, who knows? If Zerfall dies, Zerfall might want to come back as a uh, paladin. Or a thief so we can open up treasures. A young boy is rather busy doing hard work. Name. My name is Logan. Pleasure to meet you. Job. I work on this estate ever since our dear father has passed away because he was fighting in the war. Info. He didn't, he didn't die in the war. No, no. He died because not. he was fighting in it. We have many horses here. One of them that I've never seen before has arrived here not too long ago. <laughs> just, just casually wants to go into the stables, apparently. Thank you for the gold coin. I'm very grateful. Join. No. Oh. We'll, we'll get a child into combat one of these days to die to one of the death. Uh... Woohoo! All right, hold on a second. Let me see. We are in the city of Stavold. Okay. All right. Looks like there's no deaths. I need to sort my notes out. They're terrible. Watch this. You're going to love my notes. Mmm. Well, I mean, better than you're loving your nuts, I suppose. <laughs> 
A haggard, drunken derelict is having a merry time in the tavern. Name. I'm too far, far too drunk to remember my own name. Job. I work on the estate when work is available. Hey, at least they let you get drunk when it's not. Mm -hmm. Info. Uh, cigars about the shard. Mm. Join? I cannot join thee. Bye. Farewell. Is this the Is same be the exact same? Looks like it. Yep. Well, you could try name. Just to double check. He He's can't remember his name. He's far too drunk to remember his own name. He could still easily be a different person. Yep. Yeah, he is He is much too drunk to remember his own name, uh, just like the other uh, uh, besotted He is person. too much drunk. Check, check, the, check the last one, too. I suppose I should. A jovial barman is tending the tavern. Name. Brendan is my name. J job. I prepare and serve fine spirits and food here in the unusual otter tavern. Where's the unusual otter itself? All right, info. For 200 gold coins, I serve the a shimon. Shimune. Shimune. There's. How am I supposed to know this? <laughs> sometimes it would be one syllable, sometimes it's two. <laughs> uh, Le Corso and some useful information. I mean, it definitely seems like it's mixing uh, languages there. Shimune, I would say, is uh, Japanese. Is I it don't know lime or is it lime? Words. I don't know. <laughs> Do we want to give? I mean, okay. he's going to give us some useful sure. information. It's 200 bucks to find out where Shard is. I suppose. But we already... Oh, no. We only know one thing, right? Okay. Tastes quite strong. A Shard of Uthar can be found immediately to the northeast outside the city. So up okay. to the right. No. Yep. Bye. Oh, bye. All right. Let's see if this guy is... If he is just as besotted as the rest. Oh, he's so drunk. He is too far drunk. Yeah. Let's get out of here. Well, at least he didn't puke on our shoes. That's quite true. Yeah. Well, we got some guards here. And the king. The king or the sovereign. They're going to be like, give me money. I'll give you shard. We know how this works. Yeah. A stoic figure stands at attention in the court of the monarch. Name. By decree of the law, the guards of the realm shall not divulge their names. That's a little problematic. Yeah. Good job. I've sworn my life to protect the sovereign of this dominion. Info. Oh, he's a shapeshifter. There's a shard that is hidden near the pillar in the center of the city. Bye. <laughs> Farewell. Now, is it this one? No. The center of the city would be over here. Is there a yeah, pillar here? Yeah, go, go check. Oh, there yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I gotta hit space. And nothing. You find nothing. That's the darkest shard for the most brutal of ba base players. You find a shard. Twenty-two. Find a shard. Woohoo! We got ninety-nine missing shards. Now we're down to the last. Like we're in the double digits now instead of triples. Oh yeah. All right, let's go find out. How much I think this is. game is in the bag now. <laughs> <laughs> That's what this sovereign wants. Oh, God. A stone faced ruler sits at his throne. Name I am Duke Cornelius. Job. No. <laughs> Job. <laughs> you, you must answer. It doesn't I... work if you don't answer. <laughs> He's just saying the things that we always said to them. I fought against Lady Bane, but I've sworn fealty to her when the war was clearly lost. Ah, oh, so you're a coward. Info. He just knows what side his butter's on. Bre uh, his, his butter's breaded on. <laughs> well, I do like a little bread with my butter. The shard of Uthar that is encrusted in my crown <laughs> can be bequeathed for a tribute of 
10,000 gold pieces. Can we just punch him and take the crown then? <laughs> Bye. How much how much do we have floating around right now? Not I that know. much, that's for sure. I know we're not as hard up as we used to be though, but uh what do I look at equip? I mean, we're like <laughs> To be fair, we dropped a bunch of cash at that last uh, city before we went to the... That next is time true. We, next time we grind, we should be getting one of these shards, I suppose. Alright, shard with ruler, what was it, 10,000? Yep. Okay. We're going down the spiral. Oh, it's not a spiral. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, they've really changed up the path. This is much, much more interesting than a normal... Hidden path. Who's back here? Hello. You see a peculiar man standing in a brightly colored shop. That's a shop name. Apparently that was a carpet. I am Dr. Draxior. Welcome to my Imaginarium. Hmm. Sounds pretty neat. I am the creator of fine and unusual trinkets of the most powerful magic. All right. Tell us about this powerful trinket because we're only going to be able to buy one of the types you have no i could sell thee a ring of invisibility for only twelve thousand gold pieces oh man i wonder what that does does it make you intangible like just get hit way less or does it actually let you do something cool well let me take a look all right ring invisible uh it looks like it casts the invisibility spell has a five percent chance of being destroyed when you use it. Ah, so it lets someone like Lethal cast invisibility. Yes. And invisibility does. I can find it in the spell list. Um. Um. Oh, it's apparently a priest spell. Uh, prevents wandering enemies and monsters from seeing and being able to attack you. Mm. That's not pretty right. bad. That's not too bad. Although eventually we'll just know that spell. But Well, it's a level 2 priest spell. We know it already. Oh, we already know it. Uh, that's not worth that much money then. Yeah, it's, yeah, oh, yeah. Especially with a 5% chance of being destroyed. I suppose it's a good emergency measure for holy crap, it wiped all of our party except for the fighters that have mad hit points. <clears throat> Let's run and put this ring on and get out of... <laughs> drag all the bodies back to town. Yeah. It's not unreasonable. A small child is helping her mother attend to her chores. Name. My name is Shahana. Job. I help mother do housework. How much does that pay? It's not very good. Yeah. You should uh, you should uh, go on strike. I always Info. find whenever yep. a child calls their parents mother really creepy. <laughs> Ever since Papa passed away, my brother is doing a lot more things around here. Hmm. I mean, I guess that's all we have here. Bye! Could ask her to join. Farewell. As soon as I said mother, I started talking like this instead. A mother is cleaning and cooking. Name? My name is Ethelin. Job? I do my best around here since the passing of my husband who died in a battle against the resistance. Info? My husband's company was ambushed by a band of orcs who came swarming from a nearby dungeon. I never liked him, though. Give. No, thank you. Bye. Farewell. Now there is a treasure in here. Ooh. 100 gold. We're bad people. Oh no, I talked to one of them by mistake. You just know what I've done. <laughs> Info? You don't know anything. Perfect. Mommy says that the 100 gold that we have is necessary to feed the next week. And if we don't have it, then we will starve. Oh god, we're bad people. Hey. <laughs> give. I tried to give it back. They didn't want it. <laughs> I don't feel bad anymore. Alright, so I think that's all in this town. So we need to go up and to the right. Well, we heard about... Well, we got one piece. We heard about another that we need to buy. And then there's this one. So, yeah, I think that's everything. 
And then, of course, there's the uh, shop that has the Ring of Invisibility. We found a shard. Yay. We've almost got a bingo. <laughs> well, at least we get the uh, we have that free square, right? Look, well, there's a, we only need three. We only need three to get a bingo. Well, right, probably so, won't be those three. Good combat. Ooh. What monsters are around here, I wonder? So we're going to go to minus Meglindor next? Yes. Correct? Okay. Seven Lamasu and six Centipedes. Mm, I don't like you want to view them first? I do. I don't like the idea of six centipedes because... Oops, that's not a view. It's... Oh, yeah, it's info. So, Like, 1d12 is, is kind of bad, especially with two swings. They could easily kill a Mandretta yeah. with one, uh, one round. But the real issue we have is that centipedes, centipedes have, have poison. poison. Yeah. But any, any of the... Uh... I mean, they're also not worth that much XP. I mean, it might even be worth it with the with those to use like the stinking cloud to get rid of them or something like that or sleep. You know, the the really low level well, spells. Even, even the low level uh, mass damage spells, so we get the small amounts of experience we do get from it. True. Um, like, so I but I would feel like instead of running from these things, it's probably worth just like completely smoking them with Bobo and moving on. That's true. Bobo is being the wizard with the forty-two spell points uh, is is pretty pretty good. Yeah. How many hit points do these guys have again? They could have a lot, but probably not. And the centipedes, I don't think can. Yeah. Oh, one, one to two. two. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and Lowest that's why I was. AOE. <laughs> yeah, I mean that. Well, that's why I was uh, thinking like sleep. Just get rid of them all, kind of thing. Who cares about them? But I mean, it's up to you. They ignored me. I meant to ally with lethal, but I, I clicked ahead. No oh well. <laughs> oh well. See, they can roll once. <laughs> charm. I mean, I guess charm was. <laughs> just... Do we want to have uh, Grimoth attack? Or he doesn't cast have, spell, I mean. He doesn't have a um a chum. Oh right, so you try to charm one of the uh Lamasu maybe? And a charm monster. Nothing happens. Okay. And then Bobo is going to just get rid of all the level six spells. Wait, we have level six spells now? Oh, Man, my got, like, Meteor Swarm? Yeah, I think that's that's very much uh, overkill for this. <laughs> oh, absolutely! I just want. Do you want to know what they them. do, though? I do. Tell me about the level six spells while I cast a simple level three fireball. Yeah, I thought there might have been a. Fireball. All right, so um, uh, let's see. Clone the spell creates a duplicate of a fellow player in your party. The clone will serve as a faithful companion and ally of the original player. We just figured out how to get through those death zones. Yeah. Uh, gate, regardless of where you are located, the spell will transport you and your companions back to Castle Rivaria. Uh, meteor Swarm, a very powerful spe and spectacular spell where meteors from the sky rain down on all of your enemies and cause large amounts of mayhem and damage. That is all enemies. Uh, power Word Kill, when this... Word of horrifying power is uttered. All living enemies who are affected by it are killed instantly. And a time stop causes the flow of time to slow considerably during a battle, giving each player two additional attacks per combat turn. Can you do anything other than cast spells? I don't think so. I mean, I can attack. <laughs> you mean, well, you can, but you didn't. Yeah. No, oh, the centipede! Oh, no. Nice. Less nice. Nah. 
Disappointing, guys. Were, what were these guys? Mythical? Yes. So, lords what can is... subdue mythical? Uh, hold on. It Can't works. Remember. Okay. I, I tried earlier pressing buttons on people that I knew couldn't do things, and it says, that player can't do that unless you try again. Oh, okay. So it wasn't wasn't dangerous to try. Well, again. it was more like it would subdue, but it might not have been on mythical. Mm. Very true. Well, it worked. We got one. So, we got him! Yeah. I mean, at this point, I feel like we probably should let other people try to get the kills other than Bobo. There's only four left. Yeah, I'm just worried about that damage. We'll bring you back to life if something happens. He didn't even kill one. This is your chance it, to kill one. Then it might be... Yeah, go with the uh, magic missile. It didn't die. But neither did you, so... No. He's also already leveling up. <laughs> Although at this point we may want to clone like Shaman since he doesn't have a ally right now. I wonder if we can do that outside of combat. Uh, let's find out. Um, okay, ally. Charm. Stop charming things. Anytime. 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 Okay, so we'll save that till we're at a place with an inn. Ah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, actually, that's really good. It's only six mana, now that I think about it. We've got 38. I guess we're about to take a trek across. Uh, yeah, yeah. I would save I would hold off now. until yeah, until we're actually going to rest. Ally. It missed. Oh, it hit for nine damage. Nice. It killed one. Wow, nice. Well, here's the question. Do you want to try your last magic missile, or do you want to save that one magic point? Um, Go with the uh, magic missile, because, again, if we still have some points, we can always uh, clone Elmandretta, and that would be better than anything that I get with the... You just no. softened it up. Yeah. <laughs> I attacked with Ethan because I was like, maybe he won't kill it. <laughs> and he got two hits. So he's got at least two hits right now. It would be nice to know when that happens. It happens when you hit them more than once. What happened to the music? That's weird. I don't know. I haven't been hearing the music at all. I don't get music. I just paused for some reason right before we opened this treasure chest. That's just odd. Well, let's just open it up and see what happens. 641 and an item. Yeah. What item did we get? A scroll. Cotillard. Let's see. What is that? Uh, Remove curse. 25% chance that it's destroyed and it's priest caster class. Well, there we go. We got one of those sitting around in case we need it. In case we need to remove a curse. I mean, it might just be worth equipping it. And it's not in the inventory. Are we going to put it on Shaman? Sure. Uh, n Priest. Oh, Priest has to. Yeah, Priest Caster. Girls. Yeah. Does it have a value of a thousand gold? Mm, that's like 500 bucks. Yeah. Just JG. Is it? Oh, but I think anyone that can cast pre spells can probably equip it. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. But, I mean, we don't have any other scrolls right now, so. I suppose. Is that a spell the priest can cast normally, anyways? I'm pretty sure it is. Um, 
Let's see. Pre spells. Probably level three. Yeah, level three, remove curse. Upon casting the spell, the caster removes the curse of paralysis that's afflicting a player. Oh. That's not bad. I have no idea where you are. There's a bridge downwise here, which is weird. Oh, here's a place. This will tell us where we are. More bridges than are on the map. But we might want to explore this town next time. Is it about that time? It's about that time. We'll find out what town this is the next time. See you then, everyone. Bye. Well, now everybody knows. Yeah. <laughs>